Backing up your server or restoring from a previous backup point is extremely simple. What you need to do is head over to panel.simplegamehosting.com and log into your panel. Once you log in, you'll be taken to the server selector page. This is where you will need to click on manage server for whatever server you want to create a backup for. From here, you'll be taken to the console page where you can navigate to backups in the top menu bar. Scroll all the way down to the bottom and hit create backup. We can name our backup whatever we want. For this, we'll just name it test backup. If there are any files or directories you want to include, you can type the name in here. And if you want to prevent this from accidentally being deleted, you can just select locked. Now hit start backup and you should see the backup begin down at the bottom. Depending on the size of your server, it may take a while before the backup is fully complete. Once it's done, the icon should change to one of these. The top one indicates that it's not locked and the bottom one indicates that it is a locked backup. If at any point you want to lock or unlock a backup, you can hit the three dots to the side and hit lock or unlock. When you choose to unlock, you'll get this prompt explaining that you'll no longer be protected from automated or accidental deletions. If at any point in time you need to restore from a backup, you can select the three dots and hit restore. You'll be prompted to confirm that you want to restore from a previous backup. You can select delete all files before restoring backup and go ahead and hit restore. You'll be taken to a page that says currently restoring from backup, and then once it's complete, it will refresh. From here, we can come back over to the console and then we can start our server. If you ever want to download a copy of all of your files, click the three dots and hit download. If you're going to restore your server from a previous backup, it's always recommended that you download a local copy before doing so. And of course, if you ever want to delete a backup, select the three dots and hit delete. You'll be prompted to confirm that you want to delete the backup and you can just hit continue. As always, if you ever have any questions, reach out to our chat support by hitting chat now in the bottom corner of the panel.